Unraveling the phrase, whale fin, in English. Hello, everyone. Today, we're diving deep into the ocean of the English language to explore a fascinating phrase, whale fin. Whether you're an English language enthusiast or someone learning the language, understanding such phrases is crucial for enhancing your fluency. So let's get ready to splash into the meaning and usage of whale fin together. When we break down the phrase whale fin, we are talking about two separate words combined to create a specific meaning. A whale is a large marine mammal known for its impressive size, and a fin is a limb used by fish and marine animals for movement in water. Put them together, and you have whale fin, which refers to the fins or flippers of a whale, the parts that propel them through the water and aid in stability. Whale fins are not only interesting biological features, they have also made their way into our language in various contexts. Literal use. In the most direct sense, whale fin describes the actual fins of a whale. For instance, the whale lifted its fin out of the water. Figurative use. Figuratively, the term can be used to describe objects or things that resemble a whale's fin in shape or size. For example, the building's architecture has a distinctive whale fin shape at the top. While whale fin is not commonly used as an idiom, it can appear in creative language and literature to evoke certain images or ideas. Writers might use it to draw comparisons or describe something monumental, as whales and their fins suggest grandeur and grace. It's essential to understand the context in which whale fin is used to grasp its meaning fully. Is it talking about marine biology? Is it being used metaphorically? Or is it part of a descriptive language in a story or article? Context is key. I hope this deep dive into the phrase whale fin has been informative and enjoyable. Understanding such phrases enriches your vocabulary and helps you navigate the vast sea of the English language with confidence. Thank you for watching, and I look forward to our next linguistic journey together. Keep practicing, and always stay curious.